Thank you very much to Klaus and Simon for that performance. You know, I was in a bank one day, when it was robbed. A brave customer pulled off the robber's mask to show his face. The robber shot him dead. He then also shot a bank worker who had seen his face. The rest of us were looking at the floor. The robber then shouted, did anyone else see his face, see my face? To which I said, well, I think my wife might have. So that's enough of that. Tonight is the English night, but that does not mean our pupils were limited to England to find interesting shows and people they want to present you. English is, of course, an international language and also has links with many other languages around the world. Up next, we have pupils from the class 7B who want to tell us a little about a very famous author from Ireland who had a special connection with other European countries and languages. <coughs> there are many cities in the world where English is at least the second language. One of these cities is and was Paris. The writer that class have be will present an Irishman who loves French, who loves France, and who always returned to Paris. His name is Oscar Wilde. He was born in Dublin on 16 October 1854. His father was William Michaels, a doctor. Oscar's mother was Jane von Jasper Elgin, a writer. Oscar has a brother, William Charles Kingsbury, and a sister, Isola von Jasper Elgin. But this sister, Isola, died in 1867. She was only 10 years old. He married Constance Lloyd in London in 1884. But he loves boys and girls. He writes his first poem for his sister because she died. The title is Requiescent. His son Cyril, born on 5th June 1885. He was 30 years old and died in the first world war. His son Vivian, born on 5th November 1886. Vivian married Zema Bessie and got one son. He died in 1967. Oscar Wilde went into jail in 1895. He went into jail because he was homosexual. And he went out of jail on 19 May 1897. He went into exile, he never came back. He died on 13 November 1900. He died in the hotel that Paris. Hi, 
but were you, and should have replied to what they said. So if we went out, I would break into spring grass and white and blue. for that insightful look into Oscar Wilde's life and some of his works. Our next performance is the last before the interval, where you will have the chance, as mentioned, at the beginning of the evening's entertainment, to pick up a selection of delicious English snacks. Enjoy them and the company of your fellow members of the audience for 20 minutes before we carry on with the second half of the show. First, however, I want to instrument instrument class would like to take us away from the literary world and serenade us a sample of some of the English world's most impressive pieces of music. Please sit back and enjoy the music.
So, ladies and gentlemen, that draws the first half of our evening to a close. We will see you back here in your seats after 20 minutes for the interval. Please don't be late.